Hello, BookTube, and welcome to The Secret Life of Science Fiction Writers. Now, I did a top 10 of my favorite uh, science fiction uh, series. And the two, well, eight, number 10 and 9, uh, were by a writer called E.E. E. Doc Smith. And uh, his full name was uh, Edward Elmer Smith. Uh, he had a PhD, so he was a doctorate. Uh, so he became known as E.E. E. Doc Smith. He was born May 2nd, 1890. And he, his day job was a food engineer, uh, particularly in donuts. But he, he uh, received his PhD, and uh, uh, he became a chemical engineer in chemical engineering. Uh, in 1918 uh, with his dissertation and it's a bit of a mouthful but interesting it was the effect of bleaching with oxides of nitrogen upon the baking quality and commercial value of wheat flour it was published uh, the following year in 1919 uh, by a, uh, a specialist uh, publisher and uh, but at the same time, he was writing, and he was writing uh, uh, his sort of his magnum opus, our series, uh, Skylark, uh, Skylark of Space. And it became uh, known as, or he became known as, the basically the father of space opera. And he shopped this around for a number of years to publishers. Uh, no one took it. Uh, magazines like Argosy, uh, they refused it. But uh, he saw in 1927 uh, amazing stories, and he sent this to Hugo Gernsback. And in 1928, it was published as a serial in Amazing Stories. And uh, yeah, he just continued writing. But he was he was right he was working though as a day job as a basically chemical engineer or, uh, and he he did this throughout and he also worked uh, during the Second World War, uh, but the at the end of the Second World War he he started working with uh, sort of tanks and, and and farm equipment for a while until he got uh, a job at uh, J W Allen. And he became the manager of their cereal mix divisions, division. And he continued with that job until uh, his retirement in 1957. Uh, but all, during all this time, he, he continued to write. And he continued the Skylark series. Uh, and he also started another one, the Lensman series. And these are the two series that he's best known for. But he did write a lot of other material also. Uh, but yeah, he he was uh, he was into donuts in some ways, <laughs> um, and he died uh, in nineteen uh, August thirty first, nineteen sixty five. So yeah, so that's the secret life of the father of space opera, a chemical engineer, E. E. Doc Smith. Thank you, book two.